What's going on everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's episode, we're going to be showing you how to install the RT Arbor Grill with LEDs on your 18 to 21 Mustang GT or EcoBoost. In your RTR upper grill box, you'll receive the installation instructions and your RTR upper grill. Now, whether you order the upper grill with LED lights or non-LED lights, this second box will ship separately. It will include your speed nuts and screws, as well as either your inserts or your LED lights. For this installation, I use a socket wrench, both big and small. 5.5 millimeter socket or 7 30 seconds, 7 millimeter socket, 8 millimeter socket, 10 millimeter socket, channel locks, body clip removal tool, Phillips head screwdriver, a drill, and a 7 30 seconds drill bit. From underneath the vehicle, remove the 19 7 millimeter head screws from the pan. Remove the three plastic rivets inside each wheel well so that the belly pan can be removed. Depress the center post and the two fender liner rivets and remove them from each side of the vehicle. Remove the plastic rivets securing the fender liner to the inner fender. Disconnect the accessory lights right and left behind the bumper cover. With the fender liner pulled back, remove the two nuts from the stud block inside the bumper cover using your 10 millimeter deep socket and remove the stud blocks and set them aside. Remove the eight plastic rivets in the core support and remove the cover from the vehicle. Using a 5.5 millimeter or 732nd socket, remove the two screws at the outer edges of the bumper cover. Using the eight millimeter socket, remove the six screws along the upper bumper cover. With the bumper removed, you can now remove the center support. Using a combination of your channel locks and body clip removal tool, depress the cover tabs one by one from left to right to remove the upper grill. As a hint, try using rolled up shop towels to separate the grill from the cover. This will help prevent the tabs from re-engaging to the grill. Now let's move on to the installation. Following the radius, use a hand drill and a 732nd drill bit to drill three holes at each end of the RTR upper grill. Slide the three speed clips onto each RTR LED or non-LED insert. Install the RTR upper grill into the bumper cover assembly. Engage the tabs one by one from left to right. Install the RTR LEDs or non-LED inserts into the RTR for grill from the front and secure them using the supplied 5mm screws and washers. If you are installing the RTR LED lights, peel the double-sided tape backing and install the LED ballast in the location shown here. And now you can reinstall the OEM center support. If you're installing the RTR LED lighting, your harness will come equipped with two ends, one that plugs into the factory harness and one that plugs into the back of the headlight. Unplug the headlight connector and plug the RTR LED lighting connector in line with each headlight. Test the RTR LED lighting and headlights before proceeding. The only way to test this is with the vehicle running. The RTR LEDs do not operate off the headlight switch. With the RTR grill now installed and your LEDs tested, all that's left to do to complete this job is place the bumper back on your car and reinstall all your factory hardware. Thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. If you want to get caught up on all the other stuff that we got going on, click over here and check out all our past videos. Click down here to subscribe to the channel, that way you don't miss any of the stuff we got going on in our future episodes. And go ahead and click down here, it'll take you to rtrvehicles.com and you can check out all the other great stuff we have on the site.